Hi everybody, and uh, welcome to a, another how-to video by me. Um, today we're going to talk about learning how to enable network discovery on Windows Server 2012. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, it's been a while since I've done this. Um, in fact, I would only recommend doing this if you, for some reason, absolutely have to have it. Uh, generally, you don't want servers to be discoverable. Um, rather, it's better to map drives and shared folders that are specifically set to be shared. Um, it's just safer that way. It's just good practice, at least from what I've learned. If I say anything that is incorrect in your opinion, leave a comment and uh, we can discuss it or you can help correct me. So, um, should be the same for 2012 and 2012 R2. I haven't done this on 2008 yet. Um, but uh, let's go ahead and uh, take a look. So, this computer right here this server, I uh, came to my uh, file explorer, clicked on network, and what do you know? Network discovery and file sharing are turned off. It's like, okay, let's just go ahead and turn it on, right? Uh, let's make it private, okay? So it's like, okay, huh, that's weird. Why is my server still not showing up here? It should see itself, right? Well, it's not. And it's gonna try to load, but it won't find it. Um, and so that's interesting. So you come down to control panel, uh, network and internet and sharing center, and uh, look, it's still turned off, even though we told it for private network. Off, it won't turn on, it can't. So there's some things we gotta do, okay, to make this happen. This is probably why you're watching this video. Why isn't it working? So, to allow this function to work, um, we have to um, start some services, okay? So, however you want to get to services, I don't care. <clears throat> Just get to your services, and there's four services that we need to enable, starting off with DNS client, okay? So make sure that's running. Look at that, it's already running, beautiful. Now we have to jump down to function, discovery, resource, publication. Here she is. Look at that, not turned on. Okay. Let's go to properties. Let's go ahead and tell this if you want it to be automatic. Always when you boot up, um, automatic, apply. Let's go ahead and start the service. Okay, so that one's set. The third one we need to check is SSDP discovery. Thankfully, these are in alphabetical order. Look at that, disabled completely. Da, 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 da. Properties, let's tell it automatic, apply, and start it. Automatic means it will start immediately with the OS when it boots up. Okay, and the last one we gotta check is UPnP device host. Right here. Okay, so startup type, automatic, apply, and start. Okay, now we got to configure the Windows, Windows firewall um, to permit and allow this network discovery. So let's pop over to the control panel And let's get to our firewall. Give me just a minute here. Okay, so we wanna allow an app or feature through the firewall. We need to change settings on, give me one minute here. Sorry, like I said, it's been a while since I've done this. I'm having to go over what I wrote down that I did before. Uh, 
I, it looks like according to this, it will work for 2008. Uh, network discovery. So find network discovery. It's already allowed. Let's take a look. Let's go take a look in a book. Back to control panel. I want a different window though. I don't want to keep bouncing back and forth. Yeah, I'm gonna be bouncing back and forth. Um, now we're in sharing center, advanced sharing settings. Look, did it. Okay, that's all we had to do. And it's already set in the firewall. So if it's not set in the firewall, just got to make sure that the firewall and all firewalls are allowing network discovery. So there you have it. Now let's go verify what we found. I shouldn't have closed down file, explore, network. There it is. What do you know? There's my server. Okay, so there you have it, kids, ladies, gentlemen. Um, that's how you enable network discovery. Just a few services. Make sure the firewall is allowing it through. And that's all there is to it. Hope you enjoyed this video. Have a fantastic